Hi guys, welcome to Travel with Austin. I'm Austin. Today I'm here in the Nelsonville Brick Park. Now, I did a video here um, a while ago, and I went around the park through all the stuff, but when I came here, um, it looked like there was actually someone living in this brick kiln place, so I didn't get to go inside. But today I'm actually back in Nelsonville, and I decided that while I'm here, I was just going to make a quick video showing the inside of this. Now, I already did go inside and check, and there's definitely no one in there. So, um, watch my original video if you want to know all the history of this place. Um, it's pretty fascinating. But I'm just going to show you this abandoned brick kiln that I couldn't last time real quick. So, walk in here, and there's tons and tons of bricks. Um, now they're just plain bricks. They don't have the famous star design on them. So I'd really love to know more about these bricks, like, why they're here, basically. We also have some old um, steel barrels. And then over here, we have something. Um, it looks like it was roof goo. It looks like that's what that says. And then we have a wheelbarrow. Um, there is trash in here. Beer bottles, um, um, Kroger bags, stuff like that. Lots of broken glass on the floor. But yeah, and this place is pretty well lit. Um, obviously, we have the back entrance that is barred off. Um, then we have the front entrance that lets in light. And there's also this circle up here that lets in light. Um, as I said in my original video... I don't really know much about the brick making process or why they use things like this, but that could possibly have been to let smoke or fumes escape, something like that. Again, I'm not sure, so take that with a grain of salt. But it does remind me kind of the t like the TNT zone, how they have the circles on top, um, except for this one you can see the light through. So yeah, and we're just going to walk over here real quick. Um... Yeah, just more brick. So yeah, I was just in the area, and I really wanted to show this place off since the last time I was here, I didn't feel comfortable since it seemed like someone was living here. But now, it is perfectly fine. Um, so yeah, this is the abandoned, abandoned brick kiln at the Nelsonville Brick Park. Um, it's pretty interesting to see if you ever are in the area. Um, and if you watch my original video, there's a smokestack, there's that area, and there's even a chimney over there that you can all check out. Um, I guess the only thing I would say is if you come in the summer, is I'm not sure if it's really maintained anymore, because I'm here right now, and it doesn't look like the grass has been cut in a long, long time. Um, but anyway guys, that is my video, I hope you liked it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe, I release new videos each week.